Hey guys, Lord Niggle here, and today I am back with another episode of Terraria. So pretty much in this episode, I am going to be fighting the final mechanical boss, the last of the three, the uh, mechanical worm. Yes, the mechanical worm. I have four of them, so if I die, I think I'm good. Um, I think I'm prepared. I have an optic staff. I also got another life food. I'll just use that right now. Um, so I th I hope I'm ready. I I think I'm ready, and hopefully I do it. Um, so, yeah, I'm not sure. I have a flamethrower. I think that'll be good. Powerful flamethrower. Because it seems like, how much does it, damage does it do? 34, and it is pretty, it, like, shoots pretty quick. So, hopefully, that does good. If not, I have an Uzi with tons of ammo. I should actually replenish my ammo. But it just turned morning, because I started recording at, like, the worst time possible. So, I guess I'll wait till it turns night, and then I'll start fighting him. So, see you guys in a second. Okay, guys, I am back, and I think it's nighttime. Sadly, I do not have a watch because I threw them away, but I'm guessing it's... You feel vibrations from deep below? No! Okay, whoever this is, is it Skelet? Maybe this is the mechanical worm. If that was it, oh, that would be so cool. Okay, I guess I'm going to have to wait for this, guys, because I know it's a mechanical boss. Uh, actually, since I've defeated the twins and I've defeated Skeletron... Maybe it's going to be the mechanical worm. Possibly. Maybe it will be. Okay. So, I'm going to wait until it spawns, and I will see you guys in a second. Hopefully, it's the mechanical worm. Oh, nice. On there. Guys, it was the destroyer. The destroyer spawned. Look, I was right. Oh, my gosh. Okay, drink my potions. Drink my potions. Drink potions quickly. Get flamethrower. Got, got, all, got all of it planned. Oh, look at that. Oh, no. He hit me in. Okay. So, oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. I should have gotten maybe a thorns, but I didn't know he spawned little eyes. Okay, well that makes it a lot harder. Let's... Okay, so far this flamethrower is doing really good. We also have our eyes to, um, our optic staff to help us. But I think this is... Oh, okay, let me drink a health potion. Is this... This is, like, really hard. Oh, and I've heard that if you get hit head on, like, from its head, that, like, it does a lot of damage. So I'm going to try to prevent that. Look at this. Wow. Oh my gosh. Hey, these these eyes. If they weren't here, oh, this would be so much easier. I should have probably gotten a heart reach potion too. That would have been so much, so much help, more helpful. Okay, here we go. Heart reach potion actually would have been awesome. And I have like oh, quite a few, but so far he's actually pretty low. Okay, so uh, well, if I lose lesson learned, heart reach potion and thorns potion would be good ideas. Oh my gosh. Okay. If only I had stronger pets that could deal with these eyes. They're so annoying. Oh no, the head's coming, isn't it? Ah! Okay, okay. Oh my gosh, that was close. He almost hit me. Okay. Hey, what's with all these eyes? Oh my gosh. Okay. Here, let's keep shooting them. Come on. No. Dang it. Whoa. What's here? What the heck? Okay. Oh, angry Nimbus, get out of here. Okay, we haven't used that much ammo, which is good, I guess. Oh. Okay, let's shoot it, shoot it, shoot it. Oh my gosh, these things are so annoying. Don't get hit by the head. Please, no. Oh yeah. Oh my gosh, no, I'm trapped in here. Ah! No, he trapped me in. Okay, fly out, fly out. There we go. Oh, that was a close one. I was actually pretty scared there. Okay, let's keep shooting them. Oh, he's actually kind of close to half. Wow. Okay, nice. We're doing pretty good. If these eyes weren't here, this would be a piece of cake. Like a literal piece of cake. Like, it would be harder to eat a piece of cake than to defeat him. Okay? Like, I'm not even joking. Oh, my God. I, I'm actually not even that low. I thought I was pretty low. Uh, let me destroy you. Hey, where did he go? Ah, I saw him below. Okay. Hello, sir. Hello. Let's shoot him. Okay, let's... Actually, when he gets that low, let's use our... Yeah, let's use our Uzi. Oh, my gosh. The lasers are crazy. There's so many of them. Okay, so I guess we're using this for now until he comes back up where a flamethrower can reach him. Hey, come on. The, f the flamethrower is really good, though. Oh, my gosh. And it's pretty awesome, though. Like, it's really good and it's really cool to use. Oh, my gosh. Those lasers are doing a crazy amount of damage. Okay. Here, come on. Come up here. You dumb destroyer. Oh, my gosh. So annoying. Okay, let's, where, what are you doing down here? Oh, he's lower than half health, guys. This is going to be like a piece of cake. Oh, he's back. He's back. Oh, yes, flamethrower. Flamethrower, here we come. 
I love the flamethrower so much. And look how much more damage it does. Oh my gosh. This is so much better. Guys, if you are ever are planning to fight the destroyer, use a flamethrower. Maybe for every boss, use a flamethrower. Because this is amazing. Like, oh my, like, I'm not even joking. This is really good. And it's easy to use. You just need a ton of slime. Which, you could make a slime, uh, a slime farm. And you could probably search that up on YouTube. Uh, oh, oh, I just clicked off. I hate it when I do that. Okay, come on. Oh, drink a potion. Drink a potion, just in case. Oh, no, he hit me with this. Did he? No, I don't think he did. Maybe he did. Oh, I lost the cursor. There it is. Okay, here we go. Come on, we got, oh, no. There we go, okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. We're gonna do it still. We're gonna do it. We got this. Okay. Let, oh, he's down there. Nice, nice. He's actually pretty low. Ooh, we're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. First try. So we would have only lost to one, and one of them wasn't even like completely fair because it turned day. So then he insta killed me. So I don't know. I think I still got defeated by. If only we didn't die to him, that would have been so cool. Is it turning day? No, go on. Let's hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Come on, we gotta we gotta kill him. Look how close we are. Look how close we are. Come on! Come on! No! She just hit me. Okay. Drink a potion. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Go go go. Come on. No! Come on! We got this. We got this. We got this. It's so close. It's so close. No! Oh, come on. It's so close. Look at his health. Oh, it's he's about to die. Yes! Yes! Oh! Buckets of bolts, we got an achievement! I think that achievement is for killing all of the mechanical bosses. <laughs> it's a miracle. <laughs> Guys, we did it! That those all of those times were our first times defeating mechanical bosses, and we finally defeated all of them. Yes! And I got the mask! Oh yes! This is by far my favorite boss, so I wanna wear that. Let me take off this shell. Look at that, that's awesome. And we got 34 souls of might. Okay, and I actually used quite a bit of gel there, so, man, that kind of sucks. I'm, I'm probably going to have to make a slime farm, too. Okay, but that was so cool. Uh, we got a ton of potions. Let's see what we got. So, I didn't even have to use the calming potion. I forgot about that. Fallen Star, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hollowed Bars, Souls of Might, uh, Skeletron Prime Mask, and Hard Nep... No, we already had that. And we already had Skeletron Prime's Mask. So... It said when we kill them, like the jung the jungle grows restless. I think now we're able to ki uh, to uh, spawn Plantera. So I guess that's what we're gonna do sometime soon, hopefully. Um, but right now, I wanna see what I can craft with this stuff. Okay, let's go over here, guide. Hello, hello, sir. Um, uh, yes, souls of might. That is what I'm looking for. Oh, is that it? No, no, no. no. Okay, light disc. Wow, ooh, that does quite a bit of damage. I don't want to make... Oh, yeah, I can make the Mega Shark now! Oh, yes! Does that do more than the... No, the Uzi is better. What am I... What am I talking about? The Uzi is better. No, wait. I don't know. The Uzi does more damage. So I think I'll keep the Uzi. Hmm, yeah, I think I'll keep the Uzi. But I don't really need to use that for anything. Uh, so that's... It's pretty awesome. Uh, man, this is full. What should I throw out? I don't need tungsten ore, so then I can just put this over here. And then there we go. We can put the souls of might right there. Now let's quick stack everything. Nice. Put this. Wait, 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 wait. Put this right here. Boom. Okay, guys, we defeated him. And we did not get a trophy, but we got a mask, and I think that's better. I love masks. They're awesome. Okay, so what should I do now? Um, I want to go see. Nah, 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 nah. Um, hmm. What should I do? I don't know. You know what? No. I'll I'll try and think if I can do anything. Maybe something a bit fun that'll take a couple minutes. But if not, I'll just end the episode. So I'll see you guys in a second. Okay, yeah, so I saw this on a YouTube video. Do you guys know those biome chests? Those really big chests that are actually kind of but like really hard to kill. Well, I saw in a YouTube video that you can make those. Uh, so I'm, you know, I'm making a Soul of Night one, which I think is a corruption one, and I'm making the Key of Night. Um, so what you do is you go, okay? You place a chest. So let me go up here, maybe. Place. Oh, can I not place it up there? Okay. You place a chest. You put the key in, and it turns into a biome chest. There you go. And I've had a lot of trouble killing these, so I hope I get something good. And if not, well, maybe I'll just make another one. Like, they're actually really hard to kill. Okay, come on. Let's go. 
let's go. I got an arena and everything. Oh, he's actually pretty. He's pretty. He's already pretty low. Wow. Okay. Well, he was hard to kill at the start of hard mode. Okay. Hey, hey. Okay. Why'd you turn back into a regular chest? That's mean. Come on now. Ah. Okay. There we go. That was that was kind of close. Kind of kind of close. Let's you. Well, let's you. Uh, 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 uh. Let's use this. Here we go. Come on. Let's see. Yeah, but oh my gosh, he does so much damage. Okay, I'm probably I make like such weird noises when I get hit by him. I'm like, but 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 but. Okay, he's so close to dying. Uh, and I don't know if I've said. I think I've said it already. But the the um crystal one. I'll tell you after. But I got ooh a worm hook. Huh. Well, that's just. That, I don't think it's as good as the hook I have, but I, I've killed the previous one, and I got an intense crystal vial shard, and I got that from one of them, so that that's pretty cool, and this worm hook, is it good? Oh, what? I can't use it? What? Um, oh, do I have to just put it in there? E. Is it as good? Which one's better? Here, let's see. Does it go off the screen? Does the dual hook go off? Oh, wait, why am I using a slime hook? What the heck? I thought I had a dual hook. I guess I was wrong. Whoa. Okay, sure. Um, you know what? I need f six more of these souls of light. I want to kill one of these too. So I'm going to go get six more, at least try to, and I'll be back in a second, guys. Okay, guys, I am back and I have another key. I actually have no more souls of light, but that's perfectly fine. I don't think I can really use them for anything. Okay, you ready? I hope I don't get this again. If I do, I guess I'll just sell it. Oh, look at that. Look at that. That one actually I find looks a lot cooler. But this was the first. This is the only one I've encountered, like, without me spawning it. Uh, oh, my. Okay. Let me, this is actually working pretty pretty decently, actually. So I'm going to just keep using this, I guess. Uh, okay. We're, we're actually almost halfway there. These aren't as hard anymore. But I want to know if I can get, like, something different. Because I don't want... I want more stuff from them. Because they drop really cool stuff. When Like when he dropped that crystal wand. Or whatever you want to call it. I don't know the name. Dang, stop freezing. Okay. But I was like, oh, that's really awesome. Like it was awesome. Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay, yeah. Yeah, uh, let me try using this against him. Yeah. Look at look at this. Look at this. Get, get stuff... Get your own stuff used against you. I don't know how I would say that. Okay. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's kill him quickly. Okay, after this, I'm going to just end the video quickly, guys, okay? So, anyways, let's kill him quickly. Oh, my gosh, my health. No, don't die. Oh, oh, that's different. Godly flying knife. Oh, okay. Well, let's let's check this out. Godly flying knife. What the heck? Oh, my gosh, what is this? So, I throw it, and it follows my cursor. That's awesome. That is so cool. That is actually really, oh, oh, it actually does, it works too. Cool, um, I could, oh, I could use them on like really big bosses, like, uh, the, like the golem, is that what he's called? Anyways, I hope you all did enjoy this episode of Terraria. If you did, please leave a like and possibly subscribe if you want to see more. Next video after this will be Intrusion, then Pwing, then Terraria. So, yeah, just so that nobody has to, if you've watched this far, let's see, say, um, uh, the, uh, Gollum will die. Just say Gollum will die, and I'll see that. I'll be like, wow, that's awesome. So anyways, I hope you all have a great day, and I will see you guys later. Bye!